Hi, I'm Lynn. I'm speaking to you from our office in Beirut. On behalf of my colleagues and myself, I would like to thank you for the amazing support that you've shown Amnesty and given us throughout this past year. Members like you have made an incredible difference by writing to governments, by writing to corporations to demand justice. You've written letters to prisoners of conscience, you've shared the stories of brave human rights defenders, and some of you have even given us money. Whatever you have done, no matter how you have done it, we cannot thank you enough. Just this year, your support meant that in Iran, together, we helped hold the execution of Hamid Ahmadi and release Salah Shadizadi, both sentenced to death for crimes committed when they were children. You helped Ibrahim Halawa, who was finally released after four years in detention in Egyptian prisons. You were also there when we campaigned for Abtisam al saif and we all saw her being released together from the prisons in Bahrain. You helped us push our call for justice in Syria, including for the tens of thousands of people who have been disappeared and detained. And you have helped raise our voices against the arms transfers that have been causing such massive, massive suffering in Yemen. You contributed to the release of Muhammad Abu Saha, a Palestinian circus performer from nearly two years of Israeli detention without charge or trial. It is also a year that saw continued immense suffering for our people in the region, be it as a result of armed conflicts, as a result of discriminatory policies by governments both in law and in practice, and as a result of the increased repression by governments across the Middle East and North Africa, both offline and online. More than ever, it is vital to keep our work going so that we can do our best to document the facts on the ground and to keep fighting for the rights of the people. We have strength in numbers and when we work together on important issues such as these, we can have impact. And this year, the number of members supporting Amnesty in the Middle East and North Africa grew beyond our expectations. We are so proud of all the work that you've been doing to make this world a fairer place. I'm just one person in a big team, but we all know that our biggest asset is you. So I ask you to please keep this incredible work going. I'm asking you to invite as many people as you can to join Amnesty. So please do invite your friends. Together we can make the change on the issues that matter the most to you.